Naked DSL. A naked DSL, also known as standalone or dry loop DSL, is a digital subscriber line DSL without a PST and analog telephony service or the associated dial tone. In other words, only a standalone DSL internet service is provided on the local loop. The original concept of DSL was to use existing telephone lines for high speed data communication with DSL and telephone services coexisting on the same phone line, but increasingly customers may require only the internet service and see no need for the traditional phone service. Comparison of regular and naked DSL standalone DSL. In regular DSL, data transmission is carried on in audible high frequencies on a standard plain old telephone service POTS telephone line. The original idea was to use existing telephone lines for high-speed data communication. DSL and telephone service can coexist on the same phone line and do not interfere with each other. From the telco's point of view, DSL gives them the ability to sell the same telephone line twice to the same customer. It is an idea that benefits the telco who makes more money and the customer who gets a high-speed data connection without the need for installation of expensive new cables. Naked DSL is the same as standard DSL, except that there is no voice service. Telephone service is not required for DSL to operate correctly. The primary advantage of Naked DSL is financial. The customer saves the expense of a phone line which they may not need. In terms of equipment, physical setup and speed, there is no difference between naked DSL and regular DSL. They are identical, except for the absence of dial tone. Telco response to standalone DSL has generally been hostile. In the United States, AT&T allows standalone DSL for its own customers, but only very reluctantly, and it blocks third parties from providing standalone DSL over at and t telephone lines unless those customers also purchase at and t branded voice services Verizon stopped permitting standalone DSL for its own customers in 2014 but some third parties such as Brand X Internet do still offer it Verizon's own customers are required to buy Verizon branded voice services in order to purchase any kind of DSL in regular DSL a cable runs from the telephone switch to a piece of equipment called a plain old telephone service pot splitter. This splitter separates the DSL and voice bands. Thus, the customer will have a dial tone, which allows them to use the telephone line as a regular landline while they are using it to access the Internet on their computer. A cable carrying both services runs from the splitter to the cable head, where it continues on to the customer on outside plant. CD slam. In naked DSL, there is no cable from the telephone switch to the POTS splitter. Thus, there is no dial tone on the line. However, the customer could still use the line for regular telephone service through voice over internet protocol VoIP or a competitive local exchange carrier CLEC instead of the incumbent local exchange carrier ILIC. Naked ADSL2 and ADSL2 Plus provisioned with all digital mode Annex I or Annex J can achieve additional 256 kbit slashes of upstream data rate. Availability Naked DSL is available in several countries, if not nationwide then via at least one company, Austria, Australia, Belgium, Bulgaria, Canada, Croatia, Denmark, Estonia, France, Germany, Israel, Italy, the Netherlands, New Zealand. Norway, Philippines, Portugal, Sweden, Switzerland, Turkey, and the United States. Australia Andit was the first ISP in Australia to officially launch a naked DSL product live on 14 November 2007, followed by Roman 2 Net a day later. Exetel released naked ADSL2 services on 1 December 2007. Optus, Australia's second largest telecommunications provider, announced on 2 Mar 2009. Other providers include Offer Naked DSL, are listed at updated list of Naked DSL ISP at Service Australia. Many of the smaller players use Optus to deliver their Naked DSL services. Canada, uh, Since the CRTC ruling of 21 July 2003, 
Naked DSL service has been made available in Canada. Bell Canada and other incumbents typically charge an additional fee for dry loop DSL based on the band rate of the area ranging from band A to band G to consumers and smaller ISB who use Bell's phone line. Croatia Several providers offer naked DSL, but as of late July 2012, Iskin Internet is the first one to offer naked DSL nationwide on THR Vatsky Telecom's existing infrastructure by unsubscribing from TCOM's analog line and providing telephony service over VoIP. However, due to THT wholesale policy and prices, higher speeds would be too expensive for an user, and DSL Link still operates in Annex B. Denmark Naked DSL is available from the majority of ISP, as most ISP have now converted to VoIP solutions. Having two different providers for both POTS and DSL is possible. France Several ISP now offer naked unbundled DSL services, which are also called offers de groupies. ISP generally supply their own DSL modem with an FXS foreign exchange station port for a standard phone handset and a set-top box to provide television services. The first ISP to offer naked DSL was free with their free box. Germany, Germany, Germany. At least one ISP offers naked DSL service, Mnet and its version, Maxi Per. Israel. Naked DSL both Adsel and VDSL is provided by Bezek Telephony Company to customers upon request, since most homes use both telephony and DSL lines as default, the service is provided only by demand. It's possible to request to remove the telephony line function at any given time without any restrictions or obligations. New Zealand Chorus Limited is the wholesale provider for the vast majority of phone lines, and it provides naked DSL services. All the major internet retailers provide a naked DSL service. It is possible to get the POTS and DSL from different service providers. As of December 2013, Chorus provides 1.91 million ADSL2 Plus connections, of which 98,009% are naked, and it has 25,000 VDSL2 connections, of which 5,020% are naked. Paraguay Naked DSL service is available in Paraguay from state-owned Capaco. Philippines Bayan Telecommunications, Globe Telecom, Eastern Communications, and Smart Telecommunications offers that service. Portugal Portugal Telecom offers that service, called Naked, since September 2008 through Sapo Company. Simplesnet offers that service called NDSL Simplesnet. In May 2008, Zan TV Cabo announced to its investors that it will offer Portugal's first naked DSL service. South Africa Naked DSL services have started to become available in South Africa as alternatives to uncapped fiber. Various companies have started to provide the service due to high prices of uncapped fiber. Switzerland Naked DSL service is available in Switzerland from Solnet. CH DSL Solo Green CH Netstream CH Oregon Ago DSL Ionite 7 AG and Setup Informatic for Adsel and VDSL. Swisscom the operator of the POTS infrastructure plans to shut down POTS beginning in 2018 and is therefore moving all customers to other solutions mainly VoIP but also mobile services. Therefore, Naked DSL is now the default product. Some providers like iWay and Netstream, CH are also selling bundled service with VoIP usually integrated into the router. Thailand Only 3BB offer Naked DSL service. 3BB is former Maxnet, who previously offered this service too. Turkey In 2011, the regulatory body of Turkish state foreseeing telecommunications have announced wholesale pricing for government corporation Turk Telecom for providing retailers with naked DSL. The pricing included additional fees under various labels, such as circuit preparation service Dever Hazerlama Akreti or an additional naked DSL fee Yalan. Although circuit preparation service fee is one time, 
the latter is fixed and can take as much as percent 20 of the monthly bill. The additional costs was heavily criticized by consumers, as the very slight difference between Atsil plus voice over fixed lines and naked DSL services has made the latter financially irrelevant. As of 2015, all major broadband retailers offer naked Atsil service to consumers. United Kingdom United States On March 25, 2005, the Federal Communications Commission FCC ruled 3-2 against utilities commissions in Florida, Georgia, Kentucky, and Louisiana, which wanted to force Bell South to unbundle their DSL service from their local phone service. However, in that proceeding, as a compromise between the FCC commissioners, the FCC released a notice of inquiry requesting comment on the competitive consequences when providers bundle their legacy services with new services or tie such services together that proceeding remains open before the FCC. Later that year, during merger proceedings, the FCC required Verizon and AT&T. AT &T. Verizon Communications also provides it in some areas, although at a higher price then it charges customers who bundle it with regular phone service. Speakeasy also provides this service. Brand X Internet, a California-based internet provider, offers naked DSL throughout Verizon territories in California, New York, and a number of other states where Verizon dry loop lines are available. Verizon does not connect dry loop lines to a phone jack, so customers must arrange to have the dry loop line connected to a jack in their office or home. For Missouri, Socket Telecom holds a high rate of customers in the NDSL range.